Zack, I hope we can catch a big one. Fishing, Zack. We've caught something to brag about now. In all the history of the FBI, I'm probably the only one who fished out documents thrown into a waterfall. Don't you think so, Zack? I just don't believe it. Files from a waterfall. What does that all mean? It's called the legend of the new raincoat killer. George, have you ever seen this handwriting? <sighs> yes. It's Thomas's. George, I need to take these documents to Harry. He said he'd tell me everything once I take the docs to him. Those are classified. I can't allow a civilian to view them. Especially that deranged old goat who owns most of the town. I agree with George. Harry is... How can I put it? He might be dangerous. You don't need to worry. You said it yourselves, didn't you? There has never been a mass murder case in this town. That means these documents pertain to a case that never actually happened. Just look at it as though they never actually existed, either. Ridiculous. York, I'm sure you've got a plan or something in mind. Okay. You have my approval. George, are you sure? Emily, you need to continue looking for Thomas. Our search may just have become a hunt. Yes, get on it. I'll go see Harry alone. Okay. I wouldn't believe it if I hadn't seen it for myself. But Thomas? There's got to be a rational explanation for this. That George has started to change. I think the deaths of Becky and Diane had a deep effect on him. I guess this town truly is without a king now. <laughs> 